this won't fit in the embargo box, but FedEx guy just dropped off what we're pretty sure is the Pixel 6s. <gasps> I really hope. I'm so yeah. Let's could not be. have a red ah. Let's not have a raptor moment again. We've but waited I, for this for so many months. The strangest launch strategy of all time has finally come to an end. Well, not yet. We still have to see the event. Yeah. But. There's a box. Small box. Pixel 6 Pro. Ooh. Pixel 6. Ooh. But wait, there's David, more. I'm going to have to censor the noises you're making. I, <laughs> I thought I read somewhere they're not doing their fabric cases anymore. Oh, I haven't sad. seen anything other than these cases for it yet. So by the time you guys watch this, thank you. I'm guessing the um, You will see the first impressions video live on the main channel, but we're gonna get everybody's first impressions today because as one of the most hyped phones ever, uh, there is a certain set of expectations that comes with that. So we'll, we'll at least get people's first looks. But as you can tell, no chargers in the box, so definitely. The sides are the same color as the phone. That's kind of cool. That's a nice touch. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's a nice touch. I feel like that looks kind of cheap. Really? Look cheap. All right. I'm going to get out of the box. On camera. Let's do it. Mag. I do want to get a thumbnail. Oh when you pulled that black one out, the black one looks. Can so I dope. just say that looks so much better in person than it does on here? Yeah. see. The fans didn't see this. But Adam and David were like melting back here when he pulled the black. Oh, one when out. he pulled that one out <laughs> with the telephoto camera, like. So oh, I love how like perfectly weirdly rectangular the telephoto camera is. It just makes this look like it's just a random. I like thrown this together two thing. Tone. I didn't think I was gonna like this stainless steel sides, but it's dark enough that I'm fine. With yeah. It. Why is the yeah. top like matte? Oh yeah. Oh true. This is probably just it's a really window weird. for millimeter. Weight. Holy camera bump, Batman! That is crazy. Wait, I actually don't think the camera bump's as bad. I think the phone itself is. Yeah, the camera's just super thick. The wobble. camera bump is it massive, wobble. but it works Can I, somehow. These phones feel more like the Pixel yeah, Four than the seriously. Pixel Five. Yeah. What if they actually wanted to use this design for Pixel 5 and then they couldn't get Tensor ready in time because of oh, pandemic? I believe that. I could see that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. for sure. And then they just use this design for Pixel 6. In a weird way, I kind of oh. like that you can rest your finger there though, because me and Hiata were talking about this this morning on the way in. I always pick up my phone like this anyway, and I love that the fingerprint oh. sensor's there. So right. like that, it's gonna be like a nice little... I had an iPhone case that had a circle cut out in the back, minutes. and I would always... You just rest your finger so there, yeah. Easy to hold the oh my god! That's oh, that's touch. dope. Okay, so this is the welcome oh screen. God. It's just this like, welcome to your Pixel Android 12 thing. See how this thing is bouncing? Yeah. Put your hand out. Oh! It vibrates oh. while it's bouncing. Oh. You can feel it. It's just a small... Also, this is a... <laughs> this is a... Big boy. Yep. The this is definitely big feels big more like the 4XL than it feels like the 5. That's really sad to me. Yeah, look at that. It's like the same exact size, basically. Pretty that's much. That's really, really If you sad have a 4XL, that's how this feels. Yeah. This one just looks gorgeous. It really does. The colors are really It is nice. almost as gorgeous as you, Tim. I surprisingly like the curved one better. The look of it. I like the feel of the flat Ooh. display better. But I like the way that oh, I love that bounce. Yeah, the bounce is nice. I can't believe this is, like, this is a startup screen. That's amazing. Wait, that's, yeah, why, aren't the power, why aren't the buttons a uh, different color? Why aren't? Yeah, yeah. Like the, where's the like I accent buttons? I thought they were. I thought they, they were. Supposed I thought they, to. were. they were supposed uh, to, but they didn't. I missed that. Uh, yeah. I thought they were. Oh, yeah, I think much the way. Nothing. Okay, so we've got, we finally have our first look. We have, you have some impressions, right? This is like, the one thing I remember talking to them about was 
it doesn't look like any other phone and that's on purpose. Like, you know what an iPhone looks like. You know what this corner bump looks like and how many other phones are doing that. So this just doesn't look like any of those. And that's true for better or for worse. It looks like a Pixel. That being said, would you get one? <laughs> oh wait, the price, the thing we don't like, the thing we're finally learning now that we have these, $5.99 for this guy, $8.99 for this guy. And when I learned that immediately, it was like, oh wow, $300 difference. How are they gonna upsell people to this phone? But also I feel like this seems like such a tough sell because this is priced so well. Yeah. Camera, you just, you add the telephoto, 4X. I use that sometimes. Yeah. I feel like I, I like to telephoto. test that out. I have a couple of them. Uh, bigger battery and the bigger phone. But then the screen, so the screen gets bigger. 6.4 is already big, but you get 6.7. 1440p 120 hertz LTPO, 1080p 90 hertz OLED, non LTPO. Flat, flat, curved a little over the edges, and then stainless steel aluminum. I'm already starting to think this is gonna start to catch yep. <laughs> dust. Like this 90 degree lip right here is gonna start to catch dust if you don't have a case on the phone. And I also think this is gonna be a nice place to hold the phone. So it's a oh. win here, maybe a loss here. Other changes, this is aluminum rails with that matte finish like the Pixel 4 had, but this is stainless steel. Yeah, if you just look at the prices, yep. then you can say this is $5.99, is it worth it? This is $8.99, is it worth it? But if you go, this one is 300 more than that one, then it's like, it's no, a really hard it doesn't sell. seem worth right. it at all. That's but, still $100 less than the iPhone 13 Pro. Yeah. Right. To put it in perspective, uh, go back and watch my first impressions video when I didn't know the prices. I kind of was like roundabout guessing, like we have a mid-range one and a high-end one. I guessed that this would be 1000 somewhere in there. And maybe that's a symptom of like every other phone's trying to be that, but I think 899 is pretty good and yeah. I, I think 599 is really good. I personally think I like the 6 better, but you said that the telephoto camera was really good, so I, I want to see. I got one in-person demo. It was very impressive for those 30 seconds, so we'll yeah. see. This might be the first phone I buy in like six years, so six, I need to decide which one I want to buy. Six for six? Six for six. Two for Tuesday. Pixel six. It's Wednesday. Six hey. <laughs> <laughs> see ya. <laughs>